is a topic that is used as a guide. When a person understands and masters the ability of communication, he or she will be able to learn and comprehend other subjects. As a result, teaching an English subject necessitates time, good health, both mind and body, and a stimulating environment. Every teacher should have a broad understanding of new methods, techniques, and strategies for teaching the subject, as well as creative ways to disclose his or her achievements and the fruits of his or her labor at the end of the school year. The Accomplishment Report of the English Department of Crossing Bayabas National High School, School Year 2020-2021. The Pillars of English Department Highlights of Accomplishment This includes Professional Development General Scholastic Average Least Learned Competencies Interventions And Preparation and Distribution of Self-Learning Modules from Grades 7 to 10 Professional Development Achieving success in one's career requires ongoing training and education. This is where professional development comes into play. Professional development, also known as continuity education or professional learning, which is designed to teach workers the skills needed to succeed in the respective line of work. To conform with the DepEd's popular tagline, Learning by all means, Teaching by all means, the CBNHS teachers enthusiastically went through a series of lab sessions for the LDM courses with the goal to improve the readiness of teachers and school leaders for the implementation and management of learning delivery modalities consistent with policies and COVID-19 response framework adopted by the government and also to provide guidance to schools in making informed decisions related to the implementation of the different modalities. With the Rater's constant monitoring and coaching, the English group was able to accomplish and successfully submitted individual LTM portfolio. Ma'am Mary Grace E. Gomez, Ma'am Patricia V. Mendiola, and Ma'am Editha Q. Cabahog, the Rater's, continued to spearhead the teaching demonstrations done via lab sessions in order to engage teachers in collaborating and solving shared challenges and increase understanding and knowledge of the curriculum and classroom practices. School Learning Action Cell Sessions Classroom Observations Coaching and Mentoring General Scholastic Average Data shows the consolidated report on GSA from grades 7 to 10 for the first and second quarter in school year 2020-2021. Least learned competencies The department was able to determine least mastered competencies for the first and second quarters. Data shows the consolidated least mastered competencies and technical assistance provided. These are only few of the remedies extended by our dear teachers in order to address the problem and be able to help our students. Assisted students through virtual meetings and provided digital instructions through messengers and text messages. Conducted parents' virtual conferences. Conducted virtual conference to students. Provided teacher-made materials for remediation. Provided DepEd and non-DepEd supplementary materials. Home visitation to students and parents for module and supplementary materials delivery. English Department Intervention Strategies. Preparation of self-learning modules. With a desire to continue quality education, despite the current crisis, the CBNHS teachers are working hand-in-hand in, hand in the production of the modules, which involves the following processes, printing, sorting, and binding of SLMs. The grade level heads in each curriculum assign various teams to perform the task. 
the printing and hauling are usually done by the male teachers, together with the assigned print liners from the city. On the other hand, the female teachers are doing the bayanihan in sorting and binding of modules. Each team is strategically working to the fullest in order to meet the required number of modules. These undertakings are closely monitored by the school manager, Ma'am Sigandina C. Ramos, to secure a systematic and orderly flow of our team task while taking into consideration the minimum health standards prescribed by the Interagency Task Force on Emerging Infectious Diseases. Releasing of Self-Learning Modules Crossing Bayabas National High School opted of utilizing the modular learning modality. Despite the challenges we are facing, the teachers and administration remain positive and passionate about providing quality education to the learners. With this, the school work hand-in-hand in, hand in facilitating the distribution and retrieval of modules. Everyone observes health protocols during the conduct of the module releasing and retrieval to ensure one's safety. We reimagine new models of education with those best approaches, opening doors to more inclusive and highly quality education for all young Filipinos. Despite the pandemic's disruption, this new normal education raised awareness of new opportunities for revitalizing our educational system and guiding young Filipinos towards a brighter future.